little sick. It's not a big deal. I'm okay. But we got week 17 here. We got some reviewing to do. We got to take a look at what the heck happened. First off, we had the Cowboys and the Titans play. But before we hear about how they did, we're going to check out the standings. Yes, let's do that. The standings. The current playoff standings. The Chiefs are in. The Bills are in. The Bengals are in. The Jaguars, 8-8. Eight eight. Not in yet. Not in yet, but it's looking good for them. It's looking good. Chargers, Ravens, both in. Everybody's in. Patriots, Dolphins, Steelers, they all want the last spot. They all want the last spot. Who's going to get it? Whoever wins out, pretty much. <laughs> I think, uh, actually, the Bats, if the Bats win out, I think the Bats are the only team that they don't need anyone to lose, and they're in. But, yeah, there's that. And then the Titans. Titans are 7-9. and nine. They got to gotta beat the Jaguars uh, in Week 18. But that is the AFC in the NFC. We got the Eagles, 49ers, Vikings, Buccaneers, Cowboys, Giants, in. They're all in. They're all in. Um, the Seahawks, Lions, and Packers, 8-8. Eight 8-8 eight. Eight eight right now. The Seahawks have the tiebreaker. Back to our Cowboys and Titans friends here. Uh, Cowboys got the dub, 27-13. They're 12-4. Titans, rough loss, 7-9. They got to win next week. Honestly, this game didn't mean much, but it helped Josh Dobbs get some reps. Looks like he's going to be their QB for next week. I mean, it's that's probably good because Malik Willis, he's not very good. Not yet. I mean, probably will never be, but he's a rookie. Dak had three turnovers in this one. He, I had to play him in my one fantasy league because Hurts was out. And uh, he screwed me. He screwed me. Uh, two picks. Two picks and a fumble. Two picks and a fumble. But C.D. Lamb got 100 yards. Burks had four for 66. So Tennessee, they just couldn't get a ton going. They were moving the ball like a little bit. And then the turnovers helped. But they just couldn't get points. They really couldn't. But next week's the big one for them. They gotta beat the Jaguars. Bats, Dolphins, baby. Yeah, I missed I missed a lot from like the one o'clock games because I kind of just watched this one. Uh, I didn't I didn't even have Red Zone Channel on for a bunch of it, but I was still keeping tabs on other games because I had guys playing for fantasy. But this one, it honestly wasn't a good game. <laughs> Can't even lie. Uh, actually, it was it was okay, but. The Dolphins, they had Bridgewater playing at quarterback, and then he got hurt. And they had Skylar Thompson in. But Mack, once again, decent day from him. Better than the other days, but Thornton had a touchdown, so that was cool. And then J Jacoby Myers, he had one as well, so. Up next, we had the Cardinals Falcons. Falcons got the dub 21 19, or 20 19. Uh, this one didn't even care about the sun why would you falcons were already eliminated cardinals were done i mean you got pretty much two backup we got a backup quarterback third string quarterback playing uh and desmond ritter rookie so nobody cares about this one uh algier got in patterson got in trey mcbride i don't even know that guy if anything the cardinals won this one they're getting the draft pick baby better draft pick lions Bears. Jared Goff, he just ran away with this one, man. 255, three touchdowns. Great game from him. Jamal Williams. Actually, Jamal Williams is the one that ran away. <laughs> 144, touchdown. DeAndre Swift, 78 and a touchdown. Fields, Fields had <laughs> 10 carries, 130 yards. Uh, not much passing, but they just couldn't get it done on offense. The Lions just killed them. Lions killed them. And Lions are 8-8. Eight eight. Lions are in the playoff hunt. They got a shot. They got a shot. What they got the they got the Packers next week, right? Should be good. Should be good. Broncos, Chiefs. Pat Mahomes, three twenty eight, three touchdowns, one pick. Russell, twenty two, two twenty two, one touchdown, one pick. I saw he ran one as well. Yes. Oh, he, oh, he ran two in, two rushing touchdowns, rushing Russ. 
but uh, wasn't enough. Chiefs got the win, 27-24, 13 to three. Broncos four and 12. Uh, get that draft pick, Broncos. But yeah, yeah, this was. I was hoping the Broncos would just win it, just, just cause, just for chaos. They just fired Hackett. The whole thing with all the teammates coming out in support of Russ, but you know they couldn't get it done. But dude, McKinnon, Jack McKinnon, five straight games with like receiving touchdowns. So he's killing it. He really is. Um, he's he's been a solid weapon the last few weeks. He's been in the league, man. He knows what to do. But Chiefs, thirteen and three. Trying to get that one seed. Giants. Colts. 38-10, man. The Giants killed them. And this one made me sad because I, I had Daniel Jones on the bench. I played Dak. Instead, I played Dak over him. Last week, I had the opposite. And now Daniel Jones goes off. 91 rushing yards, two touchdowns. 177, two touchdowns back. Like... Oh, man. The Giants just killed them. And they're in the playoffs, man. They're in the playoffs. 9-6-1. Nine, nine, they're in the playoffs. Colts. Get that draft pick. Eagles. Saints. Eagles lost. Uh, Saints got the win, 20-10. to 10. Um, No Jalen Hurts. Minshew. They just couldn't get it going. They just couldn't get it going. They had one big play, pretty much, to, to A.J. Brown. For the touchdown, 78-yard touchdown, and that, that was it. They just they couldn't do much. Sanders couldn't do much. I mean, Devontae still got over 100 yards, but Minshew 274, one and one. Andy Dalton didn't even throw a touchdown. That's just stupid. Taysom Hill, Taysom Hill's putting in work out there. He's rushing. He's rushing. He's a tight end, but he he's a runner. Hand it to him. Yeah, I mean they're seven and nine. They're out of the playoffs. Uh, they don't have the draft pick. Uh, actually, who has their draft pick? Is it the Eagles? Yeah, so Saints were like, yeah, we got to make this Eagles pick a little bit worse. <laughs> and it worked out. They, they got the dump. So Eagles 13-3, still looking good for the one seed. Still looking good. Vikings lost. So, yeah, they should be fine. I think they'll get it. And Hurts might be back next week. Buccaneers, Panthers. Ooh, textbook Brady game. Textbook. He went off, dude. 432, three touchdowns. This was a Brady Mike Evans clinic, dude. Mike Evans, 10 for 207, three touchdowns. Longest was 63. <laughs> I think the other one. One of them was long, too. They had two, two of them were long. Two of them were long. What was it? We're going to see. All right, Evans 63, Evans 57, Evans 30. Yeah, that's whew, some big time, big time catches. But they're in, they're in. The Buccaneers are in. Buccaneers are in, dude. Eight and eight. Brady's gonna try to hold on to a winning record next week. Hopefully they get the dub. But Panthers, Panthers are done. Six and ten. Thank God. I, <laughs> ever since I got that comment, oh, Panthers still have a shot. Do they really? Do they? You think they have a shot? You think they have a shot? Commanders. Browns. I mean, you got the Commanders here. They're trying to get into the playoffs. They in must-win games. And they lose. They lose to the Browns. Carson Wentz. Three picks. He's just not going to win like that. Then you got Deshaun Watson. Three touchdowns. Only 18 attempts. Cooper. 105 yards, two touchdowns, three catches. Nice little win for the Browns. They're done, but just building a little bit, a little bit of that chemistry for next year. I mean, Watson will be back. So, but yeah, seven, eight, and one. That eliminates the Commanders. Apparently, Ron Rivera didn't know they were getting eliminated. That's uh, that's what they're saying. That's what he said. But who knows? Who knows? We don't know. 24-10. Browns got the dub. 7-9. 7-9. Man. Not terrible. Jaguars. Texans. Jaguars blow them out. They are setting themselves up nicely to play the Titans next week. 8-8. Eight and eight. Win and you're in. That's where you want to be. 
Texans, they're where they want to be. They are. <laughs> they want that number one pick. Davis Mills, next week is your last game, my man. That's all I can say. Nah, he's he's okay. He's he's just not a starter. He's not a starter. But ETN, ETN showed up. He showed up. He started with a bang, massive run, 60-yard run, and then they just didn't give him the ball the rest of the game. Now they're just resting him, but I uh, could have used more points in fantasy. I didn't need him to just, you know, show up and stop there. <laughs> but Jaguars 8-8, 31-3 eight eight, victory. Nice, solid win for them. And Lawrence didn't even have, the, he didn't even have the numbers. <laughs> didn't even have good numbers today, but... They're good. They're going to be just fine. Defensive touchdown. Yep. There. Pick six. Yeah. Another blowout. 49ers. Raiders. Nice little OT game here. Raiders. They're, they're trying to win just to stay alive. Couldn't do it. 49ers 37. Raiders 34 in OT. Stidham, though, 365, three touchdowns. Ended up with two picks, though. They kind of hurt him. Oh. Jacobs, 69 yards, a touchdown. Brock Purdy, another solid game out of him. McCaffrey, 121 yards, a touchdown. IU got over 100. He got a touchdown. Kittle got a touchdown. Uh, Jordan Mason, touchdown. You know, this was a pretty good game. Exciting fourth quarter. Uh, Devontae, big game from him. Seven for 153, two touchdowns. Waller even got a touchdown. You know, so crazy. <laughs> Stidham goes in and just he actually plays well. That's just nuts. Uh, they just couldn't get it done. They couldn't get it done. So, hey, they're ready for next year. Stidham? <laughs> no, probably not. But, hey, 49ers, 12-4. 12-4. and, four, 12 and four. They're ready for the playoffs. They're ready. Their team is Their team is loaded. Jets, Seahawks, the Geno Smith, homecoming. No, it wasn't even homecoming. They were, they were at home there in Seattle. But Geno Smith, solid game. 183, two touchdowns. Mike White, two picks, no touchdown. I mean, I told you, like, I had this Jets fan in the comments. Oh, we need Mike White playing. Zach Wilson sucks. Like, yeah, okay, yeah, Zach Wilson sucks. But Mike White, there's a reason we never heard of this guy. I mean, last year, yeah, last year he had, like, one good game where he filled in. But he's not a real starting caliber quarterback. What were you thinking? You thought he was going to get you in the playoffs? You thought? No. No. Brees Hall could have done that. Nobody else. They needed him back. That's who they needed. But Seahawks got the win. 23-6. 8-8. Still in the playoff hunt. Jets are eliminated. Vikings, Packers, Justin Jefferson, I'll never forgive you. If I lose, I'll never forgive you. Nah, that's fine. I'm kidding. I, I, it's not a big deal. It's just costing me my season that he didn't show up. <laughs> but uh, Packers did. Packers showed up. Packers showed up, and they, they showed up. They showed up swinging. They were ready. They were ready to go. Cousins, three picks. He was not ready. Vikings just didn't do it. They just didn't do it. Packers, Packers just blew them away. This game is tough to watch because I was like, all right, yeah, Packers get a lead, get a little lead, so that the Vikings have to throw <laughs> to Jefferson. <laughs> Didn't happen. 41-17, Packers got the win. 8-8, eight eight. they're right there. They're right there. Vikings 12-4. and four. Getting the one seed is going to be a little bit tougher now. In fact, I don't think they can. Even if the, Even if the Eagles lose, I don't think they can get it. So, tough loss for them, but they're going to be fine. They're in the playoffs. Probably will be a two, maybe three seed, but nice win for the Packers to stay alive. Chargers, Rams, L.A. versus L.A. Herbert gets it done. 31-10. 31-10. Chargers are 10-6. and six. Rams, 5-11. and 11. They don't have their pick. They don't care. They won the Super Bowl last year. They don't care what happens this year. Uh, Mayfield, not very good. <laughs> he was okay. <laughs> but Cam Akers got over 100 yards. Eckler, great day from Eckler. Mike Williams, solid day. Keenan, couple catches, but yeah. Hey, Chargers got it done. Ten and six. They're ready to go. They're ready to go. I think they have a shot uh, to get out of the first round, but we'll, we'll see. We'll see. 
Should be tough. We'll see where they get seeded, but 10-6. and six, Solid year for them. It's just good for them to get in the playoffs, especially if they're missing from last year. And the Sunday night game, Steelers, Ravens. Whew. Pretty good game. I mean, Pickett, <laughs> Pickett coming down, throwing a game-winning touchdown. It was Najee, right? Yeah. Oh, wait, he had here. Oh, wait, yeah, it had to be him. Yep, there it is. Okay. I forgot for a second. But, yeah, <laughs> game-winning touchdown. Beat the Ravens. Ravens are in, but the Steelers are keeping themselves alive. But I think they need some people to lose. They got to win next week, and then I think they need some people to lose. I believe they need the, the Dolphins and the Pats to lose, I think. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to check on that one, but ten and six Ravens are in Steelers eight and eight. They're right there. They're right there. We'll see what Tomlin can do. We'll see what he can do. But yeah, the Monday night game. This was recorded before. I think it'll be uploaded before too, but Bengals Bills should be a good one. Should be a really good one. Hopefully. But both those teams are in the playoffs, so it's all about who can uh, swing a little bit, show what they got. <laughs> a little preview, a little playoff preview. but And for seeding, too. They're all still playing for seeding anyways. But that's going to be it for this one.